hi all so welcome to this channel and today in this video session i'll discuss if uh, there is any way uh, to transfer the save file from ibm i to the pc uh, using acs ibm ics so yes there is a way to transfer the save file from ibm i to acs uh, using the ibm i to pc using the acs so in this uh, video session I won't use the FTP I will simply use the ACS to show you that how we can uh, download the save file from IBMI to the PC so let's start so let me show you the save file here which is present in library easy class 2 ok it's save 1 I think so you can see it's test save 1 let me delete this from the PC so we have this save file let's check whether it has data or not so it has one object pgm1 which is saved from library ed class 1 so now we have the save file and i want to download this save file using the acs so first of all uh, we need to open the access client solution and here you will see uh, this left columns left menu where you can see the IFS and here the first important thing is the system so here you can see pub400.com is coming as system for me so for others maybe there are multiple systems uh, set up but let me know uh, let me tell you how we will be setting this systems so first of all I will be deleting this so that I could tell you that how we will be doing this now you will see there are no system setup so I cannot do any transfer now just set up a system using system configuration click on new here I need to give the system name pub400.com here is the description let's say pub400 use SSL for connection just verify the connection it will take some time to get this verified okay okay now you can see this uh, connection is set up let me edit this I can edit also just uh, click on this one nothing else just close this now open the IFS just input the username and the password press enter so using this IFS you can download the save file from the IBM I to the PC let me show you how so you uh, can see that the IFS is open and it shows the default path for my user profile that is slash home slash easy class setup now now I need to download the save file which is present in the library so let me tell you slash so first of all we need to give the path qsys.lib and inside that library we have another library easy class 2.lib and my object is present inside this so let's move till this and press enter 
now you can see all the objects in this uh, library are listed here click on test save one dot file and once you right click on this you will see all these options to down to download and other other options as well but here the most important thing is you must be aware of this thing that this is of extension dot file this is not the extension dot savf which is for the save file so uh, if you download this and you, you want to upload this you want we will don't upload this so you must have to convert its extension of download so uh, let me download this using i can use all these download options but let's use download with three dot i can specify where uh, i i want to download just select desktop click ok it asks for username and password just input the password press ok and you'll see in some time the save file will be downloaded let's wait so you can see that save file is downloaded and it keep it gives me my successfully download the save file or file now let's check so you can see this uh, dot file is downloaded here now if i want to uh, upload this as well so let me uh, uh, tell you once we'll upload this back to the ibmi what we'll do we will basically rename this dot savf because we won't be able to upload this till uh, we make it dot savf so uh, let me tell you uh, how we'll be uploading this so in this video i'll also cover uploading save file from PC to IBM I using ACS so as you can see uh, this is already open to us let's uh, delete this which is on IBMI so that we should confirm that we are able to download uh, able to upload the save file which we downloaded now you can see this is deleted just F5 so you can see we are not able to do we, we once we do work object we won't be able to find the save file object now and we don't have any save file object so if we want to upload a save file using the ACS what we need to do we need to just traverse the path where we want to upload that so for example I want to upload it here only so I am at this path right now if I was not at this path what I would have done I would have to come to this path using this path now what I'll do, I'll simply copy, uh, just pick this up and paste this up. Okay, it's not coming on my system. Let's uh, use this feature. Just right click on this. Just click on upload and from here you need to browse this file just select test sav savf just click open ok and here you need to give the 
user ID and password just press enter or you can press ok as well now just wait for some time uh, as you can see it's uploading the save file so uploading test save one dot file successfully uploaded this now once you uploaded this you will see that it's by default test save one dot file even if you have uploaded this in test sav one dot savf format so it automatically converts it to dot file so whenever you downloading the file say file from the acs from ibmi to uh, pc you must change the dot file extension to dot savf and then once you upload that it, the acs itself convert the dot savf to dot file but if you try to upload the dot file extension which you downloaded you won't be able to upload that you will get the errors now let's see whether we have that so we can see we got the correct save file object hop attribute savf just do dsp savf on that we can see that object is present we can restore this using rst obj so uh, this way we can uh, upload the save file or download the save file from ibmi to the pc or to the from pc to the ibmi using the acs so that's all in this video thank you and have a nice time